Is it just us? Or are electric cars becoming increasingly popular at a very high rate? Be it in the UK or the US, electric vehicle sales are skyrocketing on the market. Whether you're looking for more environmentally friendly ways to get around, or simply fascinated by the glorious Tesla, there's a lot to like about electric cars, especially in a world where fuel is becoming increasingly scarce. In this video, we will be taking a closer look at why electric vehicles will become the norm in the future and some of the things you have yet to learn about them. To make sure you stick around till the end to get the full scope of electric cars for the future. Electric vehicles are here and they are here to stay. The electric vehicle landscape is rapidly changing as both technology and interest evolve, and many more EVs will hit the roads, seas, and skies in the coming years. Did you know that despite their initial price, electric cars are actually cheaper in the long run? That's right! Believe it or not! You'll be saving yourself a whole lot of cash in the long run if you can overlook the initial price of an EV and get on for yourself. This is probably the best reason why they are the future and perhaps the reason why previous owners of electric vehicles are delighted with them. Around 96% of those who own EVs have said they would lease or purchase another one in the nearest future. Now, why would they say that if it isn't cost-effective? Want to save even more money? Use solar power with your electric vehicle. Solar panels and electric vehicles are made for each other. If you have solar panels on your roof, your electric vehicles will increase their return on investment. So, instead of throwing away your extra energy, make the most of it. Yes. Batteries wear out and must be replaced after a few years. But electric vehicles are still less expensive than gasoline or diesel vehicles. Take a look at the running and maintenance costs, which constitute a significant part of the ownership cost of any vehicle. And it is now well established that electric vehicle buyers spend much less on fuel energy and maintenance. Why? simply because EVs have fewer moving pots than a gasoline engine, which makes them easier to maintain. Not only do they have fewer moving pots, though, these few pots have even fewer pots that could break or need to be repaired or replaced. As a result, there is no need to change the engine oil, making it easier to maintain electric cars at a lower cost. We don't know what that sounds like to you, but if you ask us, that's a massive win. Speaking of massive wins, how would it feel to know that your car won't be affected in a world where most countries are using up their natural gas and oil we saw? It must feel so good. Clearly, fuel is another cost-cutting factor, as electricity is way less expensive than fuel or gasoline. Sorry to break it to you if you're yet to hop on the EV trend, but oil prices will only continue to rise. Oh yeah, and it's the simple mud of demand and supply. The natural resources for fuel have become scarcer and scarcer by the year, but the demand hasn't reduced. And then there is the not-so-tiny issue of being held hostage by ongoing fuel tax levies because transportation is still reliant on oil. Being a dominant energy source causes a lot of different issues. The solution to this, electric vehicles. They are free of these drawbacks since they don't need gasoline to run at all. Sprinkle EVs cleaner and more environmentally friendly nature as a mode of transportation as a bonus here. We live in a generation that is thankfully increasing awareness on taking care of our environments. Reducing the use of combustion engines is one easy way to do that, and that's just what EVs are about. The increased use of electric vehicles will reduce future demand for millions of barrels of oil. EVs already sound like a sure deal for the future, right? 
But that's not all. Another important reason why these rechargeable beauties are the future, in one word, is convenience. Convenience in what? Well, driving experience, for one. Because electric vehicles lack gears, they provide an excellent driving experience with no complicated controls, and you do not even have to pay any additional fees for it. Driving in city traffic or traffic jams has never been more comfortable. Just accelerate, brake, and steer to manage and enjoy a calm, convenient, safe, and noise-free ride. Imagine being on a busy street after a busy work day and getting to press a couple of buttons and levers, and you're home. What an incredible experience that was for us. Still on, convenience is the ease with which EVs provide safe road use. How? Well, they have an incredibly high torque, which is a distinguishing feature, and a lower center of gravity that helps with both driving and safety. The torque is significantly more powerful than a standard internal combustion engine. Also, an electric motor responds quickly to throttle motions and produces peak torque from a complete stop. Internal combustion engines have an unavoidable response time and can only produce maximum torque at certain speeds. All of this ensures enticing performance as well as a great deal of driving pleasure thanks to the smooth and powerful acceleration. As for the lower center of gravity and its help with driving and safety of the car, the driving side means improved grip and steering during turns, making your driving experience easier and making you more comfortable. In terms of safety, it means that the cars are less likely to roll over and the lack of fuel means that there is less risk of fires or explosions. Now, that's one convenient way to use the road. Even EV designs are luxury for the drivers in terms of convenience. Electric vehicles that are currently being produced have the best in terms of safety and luxury. They frequently have the most recent specs and features and are designed to handle collisions better. Electric motors are extremely quiet compared to internal combustion engines and their exhaust systems. And though many countries, including some in the EU, require all newly manufactured electric vehicles to have phony sound speakers that make them sound like gas-powered vehicles in order to warn pedestrians and cyclists that a vehicle is approaching, it's still quiet on the inside for the driver and the passengers. That's just amazing. Silence indeed is golden. Get yourself an EV to experience it firsthand. If you're excited about the convenient use of EVs, then wait till you hear how easy it is to get charged. From the name, you can tell that electric vehicles use electricity to charge their batteries rather than fossil fuels such as gasoline or diesel. Nowadays, though, more and more EV battery charging stations are popping up, making it so that users can charge their batteries at a nearby station rather than waiting in long lines at CNG stations or petrol pumps. Now, also, imagine using charging equipment to charge your car batteries from the comfort of your home. How about that for lifetime bliss? Electric vehicles are definitely one of the most discussed topics in the automotive industry today. But despite the fact that we hear about electric vehicles almost every day and you being a car fan think you know everything about them, you'd be surprised to find out that there is still a lot you probably do not know about them. Don't look too far, though. We've got you covered. You might want to jot these down, if not for anything for bragging rights to know these things most people don't know about EVs. First is that there are more EV charging stations than gas stations. Yup, you heard that correctly. Though it may appear strange, there are far more electric charging stations in the UK than petrol stations. Here are the numbers. 
there are only about 8,400 petrol stations in the UK and over 25,000 electric charging stations. Over the last year, the number of electric charging stations in the UK has increased by 57%. Sure enough, we can expect these numbers to grow even further in the coming years. You may wonder, do electric vehicles have the same tires as their gasoline or diesel counterparts? No, most do not because battery-powered vehicles require EV-specific rubber, so EVs run on their own specific tires. Fancy, isn't it? These EV tires typically have lower rolling resistance to increase range, specific tread patterns, and compounds to handle the instant torque delivery of the electric motor and a higher load-bearing capacity to account for the added weight of battery packs. We bet you didn't know that. Also, another interesting fact is that the act of deceleration tends to increase an EV's range. Isn't that a little counterintuitive? You may ask. This is because of the existence of regenerative braking, an energy recovery system that redirects what would otherwise be lost kinetic energy back into the battery during deceleration phases, triggered by either lifting off the accelerator or touching the brakes, slowing down, actually charges the battery, increasing overall range. This is why EVs are particularly well suited to stop and go city driving. And that's one good reason to set your heart on getting one. If you think all these are revelations, wait until you hear what we have for you last. A real shocker. Did you know that EVs could be used to power your home? Of course, you wanted to know how. Well, electric cars are essentially batteries on wheels. Why else would you be charging them? This means that if you have the right equipment and connection, you can use the electricity in your car to power your home. Outdoor events can also be powered by electric car batteries. Say goodbye to generators and hello to electric vehicle battery packs. Isn't it amazing? And you don't even need Tony Stark to figure it out. Just get a certified engineer or electrician and you'll see how easy wiring your car to power a home is. The world has gradually progressed from innovators like Tesla being the only option for those looking to transition to green cars to a much broader range of options. As big name manufacturers seek to enter the market, the number of upcoming electric cars grows by the year. EVs are expected to account for two-thirds of all road vehicles by 2050, so it's no surprise that many big names are competing. All things considered, it's safe to say that electric vehicles will be taking over the roads, becoming the preferred mode of transportation in, say, 20 years. We can't wait. Sure enough, you have other thoughts on why EVs are the future, or maybe there are some things you're sure people don't know about these next-gen four-wheeled beauties. Do make sure you let us know in the comments section. Don't forget to like, subscribe to our channel, and turn on notifications so you'll be the first to see our next videos.